When a hole needs internal threads, a tap is used to cut the needed threads. Taps are hardened tools that have the size and shape of a specific thread pitch and diameter. Taps come in different forms. To start threads, a taper tap is used. This tap has 6 to 10 threads tapered before the full diameter threads are reached. A plug tap is used after the taper tap. Plug taps have a taper on the first 3 to 4 threads before full diameter is reached. Finally, a bottoming tap is used to carry the thread at full diameter to the bottom of a blind hole. A bottoming tap typically has one thread of taper. Before tapping, it is important that the operator uses the tap drill size to drill the hole. Tap drill sizes are standardized and can be found on a tap drill chart. The drill size is smaller than the tap size, so material remains for the tap to cut threads. It is also advisable to countersink the hole to provide a proper lead in and prevent thread burst from surfacing. Tapping may be performed by hand, but is often performed while still on the milling machine. Place a 60 degree center into the tool holder. The center will hold the tap vertical while turning. Place a tap wrench with the tap inserted under the center and the tap end at the beginning of the hole. Apply cutting oil to aid in the thread cutting process. While applying a force on the quill feed handle, Turn the tap clockwise and begin cutting threads. The center used here is spring loaded and keeps constant pressure on the tap. After each turn, back the tap a quarter or half turn to break the chip. Continue this process until the hole is properly tapped. Use subsequent taps as needed.